Casey's Good Morning Mumbai with Richie K. India's leading holistic health guru and corporate life coach Mickey Mehta returns on this Manic Monday edition of the Light of Life. Good morning, my friend. How was your weekend? Weekend was great. It was nice, fun. Watched a lot of movies. Kesari, superb. Beauty. I believe you were spotted on a TV channel. What was this all about? I think it was an evening show and I was in the, uh, not on a debate. It was a panel discussion. And from Mumbai, I headed it. It was on CNBC hours and we were discussing the happiness quotient. And the problem is that the happiness quotient of Pakistan, Bangladesh is higher than that of India. In rating, they are better. Maybe those people are more content in life and Indians probably want to punch a lot of holes in, and full of criticism. I think if that changes in India, Indians could be higher on the rating because the economy in India is booming. Things are looking so bright under a good leadership. I don't see any reason why the happiness quotient in India shouldn't be high. This is Gurmeet on the uh, Dr. Mickey Mehta Facebook page. How many acupuncture treatments does it take to relieve stress? Is acupuncture something that I need to go regularly for? My take on this is that you should better do acupressure and regular Swedish massage or regular abhyangam for releasing stress from the body, stress from the mind, improve your circulation, bring your heart back to rhythm in its beat. And that will help you because puncturing could be a little precarious if one is not doing it well or if one doesn't choose a very thorough professional. So I would say do acupressure and let your stress be minimized, rather get it neutralized and happiness maximized, joy minimized. Ask questions on the WhatsApp line 996774393. Add Mickey Mehta on Twitter, Dr. Mickey Mehta, the Facebook page. Uh, thanks for your time, Mickey. I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Thank you so much, Rishike.